Well, we have the most perfect day for you. A warm hello in every sense of the word. The sun is out and football has a special place on this most idyllic of days. A fixture ahead of us to which we've all been looking forward for so very, very long. And it means so very, very much. The scene could not be more beautiful. The pitch looks terrific. The players are ready to get started. And we cannot wait for the contest that lies ahead. Well, this really is a great venue. It adds so much character to every game it stages. So, Jim, tell me this. Who are you looking for in particular here? I've got to go for the powerful Bafatindi Gomez. He may not be an example of technical perfection, but his robust style helps him to get the job done by, by sheer force at times, and he'll plow through most offences. Yes, he'd be my pick too. It's going to be all about how they get the best out of him. So we're up and running. Out to the left it goes. to the right and it's Carrillo and that's sprayed out wide anything noteworthy in the early part of the match Jim well both sides seem happy with the patient approach for now still trying to have a good look at one another Al Hilal getting a lot of touches here but they're not making much progress plays it over to the other flank Carrillo he's got options out wide has been clubbed away did well to step in there that was more than necessary Brought forward what does he try from here and he's got the ball glued to his feet tries to get it clear and it's been taken straight back no change to the score, nil-nil it remains. Andre Carrillo, some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? Tries to get it forward quickly. didn't have enough to concern the defence. Finds himself eased off the ball. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Still, rather frustratingly, it is nil-nil. He 
He's looked long this time. And that's been levered clear. Hoists it forward. the end of the first half. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. We'll look back on the first 45 minutes. Unspectacular, but solid, and that solidity could yet be the foundation for them to, to go on and win. Good goals at this stage, but certainly not devoid of action. It is nil-nil here at half-time. Already up and running for the second half. Al-Hilal can feel really happy with themselves. The scoreline doesn't back it up, but they've played with urgency and purpose. They can't afford to lose patience in this second half. They've got to persevere. And it's played forward. And that's too far for anyone. Good run, ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. Crowd appreciates good football all round there. Well, they've seen lots of the ball. Time to go for it a bit, a bit of creativity and adventure. Forward it goes. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. to get it forward quickly. Now let's put a stop to that. And it's Gomis. Plays it out to the flank. And here's Carrillo. Massive leap! Oh, just needed a better contact. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. There is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Looking for space out wide. Very few chances to talk of, Jim. Defence is, it seems, on top here. Well, I think it's a, a fair reflection of what we've seen so far. Neither side has produced that many efforts at goal simply because respective defences have been strong. Andre Carrillo gets it, and now what? Gets it into the middle. And he's there to clear it. Well, to be honest, I think they're all showing no substance. Where's the fight? Has a pop! And the shot! Oh, fine stop from the keeper. Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper has just received an A-plus grade. Played it short. Drives it in. Heads it! This could fall anywhere. 
Is there any support? He might not need it. Turns and goes back. Chooses to go back. It's on a big chance! It's in! That could turn out to be a huge, huge goal! What a great finish, but how about the touch? It just allowed him to put the ball exactly where he wanted it, and the rest became a formality. Ah, oh, now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's, it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts, because he has put in a real honor shift. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. I think the danger for them now is fatigue. I think when the body tires, the mind soon follows, so concentration is key from here. to the cross Peter they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver that'll be a throw hoist it forward just a few more moments for them to hang on. What an adventurous run from a defender. Great leap! Knocks it away. Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue this situation, and it needs to be any time now, really. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. Side that time. And that's that. What a game. End to end, it flew by, and in the end, it all came down to just the odd goal. More reflections then, Jim. When you get free-flowing football out wide with consistency,